Hey, what's going on guys? Jake the Happy Snake here, and welcome to part 55 of Pokemon Emerald. Last time, I did the 6th and 7th Trick House puzzles, got myself a Magnet and a PP Max. This time, I'm going to be getting the other PP Max in the game, which is right here at Team Magma's Hideout, which is something that I missed when I was here before. And also in this video, I am going to be going back to Meteor Falls, because now that I have the HM for Waterfall, I can access a, a whole other area in Meteor Falls that I wasn't able to access before. And there's a couple of awesome TMs that I would like to get. And there's also a couple of trainers there too that I, I would like to fight. But I'm going to be starting these off uh, at Team Magma's hideout. But before I go inside, there's actually a burn heal right over here that I missed when I was here before. So now we have that. And because I'm going to be needing strength and waterfall... In this video, I have Bertha in my party, and I put my laptop in the PC. And I'm going to go ahead and teach Waterfall to Bertha right now before we go any further. Um, because, like I said, we're going to be ne needing that for Meteor Falls. So, there's only one move that I can get rid of, because these three moves are HMs. So, I have no choice but to get rid of Miss, which I'm fine with, because Miss is a crappy move. And yeah, Bertha now officially only knows HM moves, which is kind of funny. Uh, yeah, Whalmer, in my opinion, is one of the best HM slaves you can have, um, as well as Tropius, of course. But uh, yes, let's go ahead and spray a Repel. I don't know why I'm looking at my Pokeball slot. All right, so let's uh, let's go ahead and do this. So yeah, it's kind of funny. There's only two PP Maxes in the entire game. I got one in the last video, and I am getting the other one in this video. So it's kind of funny. But anyways, uh, you're going to want to go all the way down here. And... Right in this room, right here. Yeah, I, I don't know how I missed this before, but I did, apparently. And there it is! Yeah. So that's the second PP Max. And now I have both of them, which is awesome. It, it is a really good item. I'm looking forward to using them. Um, now, I'm going to go ahead and use a escape rope to get out of here. Uh, I could just scroll a little bit up to the top. <laughs> but whatever. Anyway, so now I'm going to go, uh, I'm now going to head towards Meteor Falls. However, I'm going to cut all that out because you guys don't want to see that. So I will see you guys right outside Meteor Falls. All right, guys. So here I am right outside Meteor Falls. And let's go ahead and go inside. So yeah, you remember this place? Yeah, this place is very, very cool. Uh, the music is very unique. This is the only place in the entire game where you hear this music. And now that I have Waterfall... We can go up, and there is actually lots to lots to do up here. Uh, first, I'm gonna check this out. Okay, no, something there. Um, but yes, you can see that there's an item over there to the, to the left that I would like to get. Um, nope. Okay, that would have been a great place for them to put a hidden item, but they decided not to, I guess. Um, anyways, so here we are. Um. Yeah, this uh, really is one, only one place that we can go. Um, so this leads to the area where I was just showing you guys. Yeah, this is the TM4 Iron Tail, which I'm going to be teaching to Volster. And my repel's effect wore off. That is a different repel, by the way, than the one that I sprayed at the beginning of this video, because there's no way a repel could last that long. Um, so, yeah, so we'll spray another one. Um, yeah, so we got a TM for Iron Tail, but that's not actually the TM that I'm looking for. I'm looking for Dragon Claw, and I know exactly where that is, so I'm not too concerned. Um, okay, wait. Okay. Um, so anyways, we got a double battle right here. Um, so, let me see what I would like to do. Um, I guess we'll just stick with that, I guess. Yeah, that's good. Wait a second. No, 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 no. Wait a second, wait a second. You're gonna be seeing some Dragon types in here, I think, so... Let's go ahead and take the amulet coin away from Voltster. And let's... Well, why am I trying to use that? No! Don't use it. 
Give it to Emily. There we go. All right. What's up, old people? We've always battled Pokemon together as a twosome. We've we've confidence in ourselves. We've confidence. I think you forgot the word got, but anyways. Medicham and Hariyama. Alright. Um, this is perfect actually. I'm gonna use Earthquake because that's not that's not gonna affect Emily. So well I guess it doesn't really matter because she's gonna be flying anyways. Oh wow, of course. Wow. That's just great. So it looks like it's only gonna be affecting Hariyama. Yeah, it looks like it's only going to be affecting Hariyama, but whatever. Alright. Uh, let's use Earthquake again! And Fly is going to knock out Metacham. So, so there we go. Dear wife. <laughs> okay. Oh, and they're gonna... They're... Why do I get both of their phone numbers? That's kind of creepy. I don't want two old... Two random old people's phone numbers. Anywho. Uh, this guy... Is... I, this guy is actually the only dragon tamer... Tamer? Tamer! In the entire game, as far as I know. Which is very, very interesting. Um... Yeah. So that's, uh, that's your fun fact for the day. Or of the day, I guess. I don't know, guys. My commentary might suck. And I will tell you why. This is... I'm not even joking. This is like my 80th attempt at trying to record this video, okay? I am exhausted. Um, my voice is starting to really, really hurt. And quite frankly... Yeah, I I'm just starting to lose my mind a little bit because like I said I've been recording I've been trying to record this for like the past hour, so that's why my commentary might suck a little bit. Um anyways, let's go ahead and use Blizzard because that's a for sure one hit KO. Oh yeah, one other thing I wanted to point out. I did get Wheel of Fortune on the Switch, like I said I was going to do in the last video. And I said in the last video that I did not have Wheel of Fortune on the Wii, but guess what? I actually do. And all I had to do when I was making that video was look up and I would have seen it because I'm looking at it right now. Um, so it's kind of funny that I didn't that I, that I didn't do that. But yes, I do have Wheel of Fortune on the Wii, which means I have it on four different systems. The Wii, the Wii U, the DS, and now the Switch. So, yeah, and I'm actually thinking of getting it for the N64 because I want to see how, how outdated the game is. Uh, anyways... Now that we're done with that, what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to uh, go down here. If you go down over there, you'll just be going the the, the other w place that we were at earlier. Um, but you're going to want to go over here. And those are the only two trainers in this place. Um, there is another area over here. Which has a PP up! Which is great! Uh, now I have five of those and uh, f two PP Maxes, which is great. Uh, so I'm gonna have a lot of fun with those. And I did. I said in the last video that I didn't want to use um, all my PP ups and PP Maxes yet, just in case I fi find another PP up. And I'm glad I didn't because I did find another one, and I'm still not gonna use them because who knows? Like maybe I'll find another one. I don't know. I don't actually know. I don't actually know how many PP ups are in the game. Uh, I might look that up. But this is what I want right here, okay? This is the TM for Dragon Claw. And I am going to be teaching that. I'm going to go ahead and teach these TMs to my Pokemon right now. I am going to be teaching that to Emily, which might be a bad idea. First of all, I'm going to teach Iron Tail to... Uh, well, wow. Hmm. Almost all my Pokemon can learn that move. Um, not Bertha, obviously. Uh, definitely not Emily, definitely not Mudstorm, possibly Betty, maybe Nightmare. Uh, I'm going to teach it to Voltster because that, I mean, Ash's Pikachu knew Iron Tail in the anime. And honestly, I think it'd be better than then to have Slam, I think. Because it's got the same accuracy. Uh, and it's got 20 more power. So yeah, I'm going to get rid of Slam, I think. 
Well, not I think. I know, because I clicked A. So, yeah. Uh, and... Dragon Claw is the second TM. Um, and I'm going to be teaching that to Emily. Which might not be the best idea, because Emily's got more... I mean, Emily is a special attacker. And she currently has Dragon Breath, which is, which is, a, which is a special move. But Dragon Claw is a physical move, so it might not be the smartest idea. However... I always look at in terms of power, which isn't always the best idea. Um, I'm just going to go ahead and teach a Dragon, Dragon Claw anyways, which it might not be the best idea, but I feel better if I have a, a power, more powerful attack. But you can't, you can't always go by that. Uh, anyways, there's one other thing I would like to do, and I'm going to go ahead and waste my repel, okay? You can find wild bagons b back here. This is the only place you can find them, is back here. Like, literally in this area. It's the only place you can find bagons. There is a rumor, I'm not exactly 100% sure if it's true, but there is a rumor where they, that there's a better chance of being able to find a shiny, uh, a shiny Bagon. Um, I don't know, um, we found a Soul Rock. I don't know if it's true, I don't think it is, but there is a rumor that the, your chances of finding a shiny back here are stronger than, than they are normally. Again, I don't think this is true. Um, there we go, we, we found a bag on. Now, it's only level 25. Fun fact, I think I mentioned this before, it, way early on in the Let's Play. Uh, I was actually planning on uh, catching a bag on and using it in my team instead of Emily. It's instead of Altaria. Um, but then I decided that that would be too long to wait, plus it's level 25, which is literally half, that's, that's more than half of the levels of the, of the rest of my team. And so that would take forever to train. Plus, it doesn't evolve into Salamence until until level fifty, uh, which actually, if I was to train it up, it would be it, it would have to be at level fifty anyway. So never mind. But still, I mean, it would just be a kind of a pain in the butt. I am gonna catch this thing though because um, I am gonna catch this thing because um, I, I don't know, just just because I guess I don't know, just because I like catching things. And the catch rate is not very high. Um, I don't want to waste all my Ultra Balls. And of course it broke out. Um, I, yeah, I just want to catch this thing just because. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna put you to sleep. That's what I'm gonna. That is not sing. Dang it! Ah. <laughs> uh. Okay, I encountered another one. This one's level 35, uh, which is a lot higher of a level. So I could actually train this up. If I wanted to, but I'm not going to because I'm very happy with Emily. Uh, I did put it to sleep, and I'm going to attempt to catch it again. Oh my gosh, and it's going to wake up. Oh my goodness. Stop doing that! Oh, for goodness sakes. Okay, I'm speeding this up. Alright, come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. One. Two. Three. Yes! Okay, thank you. Again, I don't need this thing for anything, but I just like catching Pokemon. Okay. I'm gonna call you... Uh... I'm gonna call you Harold. Sure. Even though... <laughs> Even though you're a female. Anyways, guys, um, I am going to end the video off here. Um, I am, so yeah, what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to stay here and search for a shiny, just to see if that rumor is true, and I'll add it into the video. Uh, I'll add that part into the video if I actually do happen to find one. But I will say this right now, guys. I'm going to end the video off right here. Uh, next time, I'm going to be starting starting the video off in specific log town because next time, I'm going to be catching another Pokemon. Another Dragon type, actually. However, it's a lot better of a Dragon type than Bagon, if you can believe that. Uh, so I will be doing that next video. So, guys, I'm going to end the video off here. Thank you guys very much for watching. I really, really appreciate it. And I will see you all next time. Peace!